uh, Solary Glutiny from France. We have uh, Mr. R facing him on winner's side there. And then on the other winner's semi-finals, we've got Quick, uh, another top player from Germany, perhaps the top player from, 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 from Germany, versus Al Babies. Then on the loser's side, which is where we're going to start, we're going to be jumping into our first game. Um, it's going to be uh, Light versus Siski. So oh, yes. it's going to be quite a uh, heavy one. If I'm not mistaken, we're looking at... Um, Germany versus Spain here. So we've I've been watching a lot of Siski that did this weekend and been very, very impressive uh, throughout the entire tournament, consistently dominating yesterday and going mm. into this first game as well. Yes, lots of excellent play from Siski throughout yesterday and today. And already you can see here, this match is patching, qu packing quite a punch, should I say. Both our players going absolutely nuts with all projectiles. I'm seeing Siski here utilizing the bombs and Okay, <laughs> with the forward grab. Okay, apologies. I'm just trying. I haven't got. I haven't got. I've got a, 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 any game feed right now. Oh dear. All oh. right, we're taking a strong look here. Light is pretty much trying to keep himself on the stage here, but uh, our Siski player now trying to keep himself forward here. But edge guarding happening here from, of course, Light on the side. And there's that forward smash taking a stock off of light. Oh, okay. Taking off. Uh, all right. <laughs> I'm just okay. <laughs> Apologies, man. I'm just trying to find the game for you. No problem ah. at all. No problem at all. Okay, there we go. I think I think I have it now. Finally. No okay. problem at all. Right, that, that sure took its time. I, I, one of the links I had decided to not be the right one anymore. So No, for, well, for a split second, my, mine actually stopped there for a split second as well. So uh, apologies for the uh, sudden quietness from us, guys. <laughs> right, indeed, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm back in. Here we go. Right, it's a two shots apiece. Uh, yeah, Siski, uh, as I've said, he's been really, really impressive. I mean, a name that I haven't heard too much of overall from the European community. So, um, you know, obviously Spain is, is is a country that we generally see, see less of. So it's kind of nice to see the players from from that area, you know, really show up and just you know, put on some fantastic performances. Um, and yeah, this weekend's been really, really good. You know, making use of you know a lot of the stuff that we see from 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 Samus. You know, really, really tricky movement, nice conditioning game, and you know, just, just trying uh, their best to just be as uh, I guess confusing as possible, making it hard to like make a a, de a decision. But um, uh, Light, as we know, really experienced player, and you know, obviously being from Germany as well, Plaz played Light a lot, and Light, uh, uh, sorry, Quick a lot, and Quick obviously one of the best Samuses in the world. So um, the differences between Dark Samus and Samus are so minute. Um, things like height of the of the uh, charge shot and all, all that kind of stuff. So uh, yeah, Light looking to go a little bit out wide just to try and get that stock back. Early counter gets hit by the, by the rocket, a bit unfortunate on that timing there. Just trying to get something going, but you know, you can just see Siski slowly racking up the percentage consistently and uh, having that lead push away from them. Yes, indeed. Even with a very high percentage for Siski, he's still obviously having the lead with two stock, but not holding back, Bowie. Not holding back. He's just yeah. going straight in for it. And um, yeah, that's going to have to take that first game. Seemed like a little bit of an error there. Like, got I think Light wasn't really aware, well, not aware, not not lacking awareness, but got hit by by the bomb somewhat. Um, and maybe like just threw off the timing a little bit, went too low, tried to recover with the teleport, but didn't have the distance on them. So sadly, um, falls behind a little bit there. So game one going over to Siski. Uh, we yes. could, I mean, if this goes how it's going to go, I wonder if we're going to see a character swap coming up from Light. Obviously, we... we've seen Light play a lot of characters, but, um, you know, should be solid enough with uh, yes. sticking to, to the, the Palu. Absolutely. And of course, our previous commentators were mentioning they, that we could potentially see some different characters from Light. Um, will we stick with Palutena? We could potentially, of course, see a Sheik or maybe Mario, as I like <laughs> to call him. We might see the Mario. Who knows? Um, but our players, I think, are selecting at the moment. Well, pa um, Siski, I think, is coming straight back in. Yeah, um, Light having a little, little bit more of a moment just to think about it. I mean... Mm -hmm. Gather his thoughts. Gathering his thoughts. Yeah. I think when it comes to Light, he's one of those players where like, he has a he has a deep love of, of Sheik, just a move set and everything about about the character. He's been obviously trained so much and played there so much in uh, Smash Four that when it came to Ultimate, he was you know he's been mentioning since day one, and it's it, I'm going on about it by even mentioning it here. But uh, you know, it's quite sad that he can't use her. But does bring out the Mario as you mentioned. There we go. Yes, let's um, go. 
you've got the vanilla combo man himself. So yes. <laughs> super, super solid in everything. Vanilla he does. combo nice man. <laughs> okay, so jumping All on right. to Battlefield as well. So yeah, again, I mean, an obvious pick for Mario, I believe. Obviously, just, you know, the platforms are something that are going to allow Mario to augment his combo game, keep those up air strings going where necessary, uh, and even maybe trying to pull for those kind of like, you know, either the, the down air or, so, or up B for, um, finishes when building those ladders. But uh, we'll see how Siski can deal with this, with, with this matchup up and get stuck into the, the into this, this next game good dash away turn around charge shot just to punish the attack from from light there we go and already we can see a siski has racked up quite the percentage of course on light but light isn't giving up that easy he's trying his very much best to get siski just to the side of the stage using that beautiful up combos that's it there we go racking it up racking it up and there you go just like that yeah, that's what I was mentioning, the uh, the ladder combo is being augmented by those platforms, and that is it in practice. Nice early start, gets that lead, and here we go. Get, uh, ooh, okay, yeah, just fell through the platform to get 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 the re-jump, but tried to follow it up, uh, didn't get anything from it, though, but nice percentage, 50% there. Um, and yeah, patiently waiting for the bomb to explode before jumping up, ooh, rolling into the charge shot, <laughs> and then the up to cover the roll. Up tilt, not going to take oh, that stop just yeah, yet. The stage, stage bounce not going to happen, but the forward air is going to be enough. Okay, equalizing it without too much of a runaway. Oh, oh right. there it is. Okay. Yeah, these spot dodges. Uh, the thing, the thing with forward air is it is quite a lasting hit um, hitbox. So the decision to spot dodge here, again coming out from like it's been being being punished a lot from the, um from from this, and it's one of those things to argue about. You know the uh, the 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 general um, nature of, uh, of 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 online players being a little bit uh, changing in terms of like the timing you're meant to be going for, and maybe these spot dodges are. Um, you know, just mistimed from like for that reason, you can't ever say. Um, but this is really good stuff. So many up tilts <laughs> coming out and hits coming out from Siski. Nice jump cover as well with the up B2. Screw attack is uh... still not enough. Still not enough. He's still in there. No, but this, that charge shot there, not being able to KO from the other side of the screen. Good grab up throw will be enough at 180% for sure. There you go. Okay. Just jab, charge shot, grab. Ooh, okay, <laughs> looking for the uh, yeah to the jump up down air, but uh, yeah, I think the roll in nice stuff from light to keep himself going. Finally, getting that cape timing, good stuff. That gorgeous cape timing there, that was yeah. <laughs> okay, good tech. Okay, yeah. So uh, going off stage, nice. Okay, waited for an option, fit punished with the up smash. Good pressurizing coming out from light going off stage and really trying to find something there, but that was um good patience from Siski and just making sure that they, that they had the ability to recover in the end, not overextending themselves or like making any kind of like rash moves and putting themselves in danger of getting the, uh, the offstage pressure. But um, yeah, you can see the percentage lead is very much in their favor. Any kind of big solid hit from, from uh, Samus at this point at back air, you know, is going to at these sweet spots going to be important. But look at this ladder combo. Couldn't finish it. Okay, it is a very, very intense situation here, both, of course, on the last stocks. Mario is bringing, of course, that stock back, bringing that percentage up for Siski. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, 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 that ladder was really ambitious and really, really mm. well executed, but it's not even just, yeah, it's kind of scary. Anything huge from Mario can do it like, like a sweet spot spare, a sweet spot um, sm sm F smash, sorry, excuse me. Probably would take it at this at this percentage because rage still is a thing. But there's the forward air catches oh. the jump on. Mm. There it is. Okay, so that's two zero then to Siski, looking very strong right now in this match mm. against Light. Obviously, one of Germany's best players looking to go out of the tournament in seventh here at the Coca-Cola Breakpoint Ultimate Finale. That's looking pretty solid, I must say. Um, there was a lot. I mean, generally came back quite nicely there, I, I, I do believe. But um, yeah, we'll want to see if uh, what well, either if we're going to see you going back to Palutena or sticking with the Mario. This is a big question mark to add in for for Light. I feel like he's maybe not going to. I mean, I want to say that he could maybe bring out the Sheik, but I'm not personally that kind of going to jump to it. That, 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 that that's what he should and will do. But we'll have to see. Um, it, it was it was interesting to see like play like live in action there he was he was playing quite cautiously uh, mm. uh towards the end there of course and the brilliant play using of course utilizing full capacity of the cape uh right. 
avoiding any kind of like forges projectiles knocking him off but siski as we just seen here even from yesterday and today is coming full force uh just going straight for the blows and just regardless of just anything just trying to just keep that ammunition just going at the beginning of mm -hmm. anything so it doesn't it, it doesn't give the other player any time to really just even think um yeah. so you could see there that light was actually trying to pull back just a tiny bit just to really think about what he needed to do and was proven that he actually you know was doing the right thing there so this next game is going to be uh an interesting one i think for say back to the palatina uh it makes it, it makes a lot of sense uh, i think that he's been playing palo since since the beginning of, of the game unleashing so it's kind of one of those things that he has most experience with with this character and it, and, and also kind of like that kind of uh, uh, the argument of being a higher tier character bringing that out obviously is the right shout um so we're on to uh um smashville then uh, for our third game. Is it going to be the last game that Light has in this tournament, or will we start to see that slow comeback? Will we see the reverse 3 Oh, Who can say? But uh, game three is, un is un underway. Yes, indeed. And of course, Palutena racking up already once again, a little bit of quite a high percentage. Siski still trying as much just to completely just go at it, throwing as much and as, as many moves as he can uh, at, the, at our Light player. Three stock will be still for both of our players, but it's a bit of a bit of a bit of an edge situation going on here. Yeah, it's uh, interesting to see. Um, I, it's this is kind of interesting just because um, Siski's play is just so solid at covering so many options, and I think there is something there is something to be said about players who have probably spent more time. Nice again, get, getting that coverage with the forward yeah. air, that lasting hitbox landing, and that final finisher. Very very solid. The shield coming into play um, as a part of. Um, as part of Palutena's game, I, I want to see maybe uh, how uh, Light can perhaps make his choice, his move selection, just to be a little bit more, just to, just to try and keep himself safe in these kind of in these more intense exchanges. There's that down air, not getting the uh, the bounce, but pushing away, uh, landing the fair into the up B. It's such a quick move, so you have to be quite careful there. Teleport to landing. Okay, yeah, opts for the up air, does connect and keeps an un, un, kind of like pushes away the pressure a little bit that Siski was trying trying to build. Um, but again, keeping this pressure up, stock lead and almost lapped in percent to range. That's the thing. The thing is that like Samus can play at such a solid range and it's a scary range um, that you have to try and get in get into. A, a Samus that's in control and in kind of advantage state is really difficult to deal with. Uh, <laughs> you want to try and break down that 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 boundary and. Palutena does, again, here, we're, we're seeing, putting up quite a fight here, though. Palutena holding out strong, avoiding it, but just not enough at that edge guarding there. Siski has really mastered the art of applying that pressure to light on the sides of the stage. Yeah, this is looking really solid right now from, from, from Siski. The quality of this player that, you know, as I say, haven't heard too much from them myself, but really making an absolute show. Fantastic output generally from them all weekend. And I think maybe that perhaps a little bit of extra time to just to get used to the environment and, and uh, you know, keeping themselves warmed up has really been paying off because they're making fantastic decisions the entire time and uh, calling out a lot of the, the decisions that, that that light is making. Um, like we've seen so many like jumps from ledges being 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 covered and just yeah the pressure has been so solid you can see the movement never letting this palatina get away and get to a comfort zone making decisions that anticipating every position that he that that they can is just causing such dominance really really impressive stuff <laughs> okay the roll gets covered there but, or maybe it was a little spot dodge but yeah the uh, charge shot covering <laughs> okay forward air into explosive flame I like it all right here's some here's some brilliant play happening here from light really utilizing this edge guard keeping siski at bay yeah i think that there was great from light he's just trying to extend that a little bit longer just trying to hold on to that pressure when he did have yeah. a little bit of, of of advantage and now that's opened up again and that's a, and that's a real shame i mean light still has got that ability almost getting that stock back that would have been really important to take but whew, okay throwing out a counter really early there That's okay we are down to one a piece but of course light does have to play it very carefully here at the moment mm. that charge shot is so scary it charges a lot faster than than you might think and it's it's uh it, they are just the priority and the power it has is something to be very very afraid of lots of damage coming out of that and shield damage it's a, a real pressure tool 
just holding onto it is just enough to like force options. Very nice, there a double bomb. Is. Wonderful, wonderful, is. great. 3-0 from Siski, putting light out of the tournament in seventh place. Wonderful finish there. The double bomb with enough distance to force the get up from the ledge. Otherwise the bomb below is going, going to hit. So it gets up into the second bomb, which hit stuns into the charge shot. Fantastic finish from Siski. Good timing on that setup. And that is a 3-0 clean victory from for the, the Spanish Samus, putting light out in seventh place. Wow. Excellent, excellent play from